Hey Guardians, this video is going to explain everything you need to know about getting through and getting the chest in Golgoroth's maze. After beating the War Priest, you enter some tunnels that lead over to Golgoroth. These tunnels have a small puzzle that unlock a door with a chest, that you will probably need to get the moldering shards necessary to obtain a double drop at the end of the raid. Here's what the maze looks like. As you can see, there are four circles in green that show areas where there will be a small manhole on the ground. These manholes are triggered when you step on them and must be pressed in the order marked in order to get the door open that contains the chest, marked in yellow. Four guardians should pick a certain platform and get over to it, while avoiding random pits scattered throughout the maze. Pits are usually marked with some small flying moths above them. Also, if you happen to fall into a pit, do not revive yourself. It will respawn you at the beginning of the maze. Manholes 1, 2, and 4 are pretty self-explanatory, but 3 is a little more difficult. It requires you to jump onto a rock across the hallway and jump over the door blocking your path number 3. This might take a few tries, but should be fairly simple. I also suggest putting one guardian near the door to the chest, who can confirm when it's open. Once everyone is in position, start stepping on the platforms in order. You should hear a loud sound, and then it will stop. Once it stops, the next person in the sequence can jump on. If someone steps on incorrectly, the loud sound will continually keep going off. That's no good. Everyone should head over to the chest and crack it open. After you are all good, you can head to the exit and get prepared for the fight with Golgoroth. Thanks for watching everyone, and for more raid content, head on over to destinydb.com.